So hello, how are you today? In today's video, I'm going to show you how to create a heat map without a custom visual, okay? So this is another wind data set, the one that we always use, and we're going to do like this. We're going to, we want to know how much we sell per month. Um, so we put the year, we put the month name, and then we put sales. And we're going to put that as a matrix, okay? So we can actually see sales per month. And we want to see this as a heat map. It's actually a, quite a good way to visualize the data when it's, you know, when it's a lot of data. So we go to the format pane. The first thing we're going to do is remove the subtitles. We don't want that. And uh, this is how we do it. We do it with conditional formatting. We go to the... Um, fields pane and uh, in values you click on the little arrow and you go to condition formatting background color <coughs> this is what i'm going to do i'm going to do divergence so i want to range from red to yellows to greens and uh, let's very quickly change these colors because i think they look absolutely hideous the... so that's how i read we're going to change the yellow too And then we're going to change also the green, which is going to be step three. Click OK. And we get our heat map. Looks gorgeous. There is one problem though, where there is no data, it's painting it red, and we don't necessarily want to have that. You have a few options on how to fix that. If you go here, you have default formatting, you can do specific color and maybe have like a gray, that's quite harsh gray. Ooh, how are we supposed to pick any color in there? Seriously. Okay, I'll show you anyhow. You can do it in Photoshop and then put it here, okay? So you can have it like gray or you can just simply say, hey, if it is white, I mean, if there is no data, just don't format it. Leave it white. And that's what you will get. So this is a easy way to see your, um, you know, when you have a lot of data in tables or in matrix. And you can easily see that in 1998, April, it was your best year ever. So quick tip. Um, I'll see you again on Friday with another Dax Fridays. Not sure what is it going to be yet, but hopefully something good. So take care. Bye.